Hello from K15T Software, the developers of Scroll Versions and Atlassian Confluence add-on. In this screencast, you'll learn about Scroll Versions concurrent version management feature. You'll see how you can manage multiple versions of pages in a single Confluence space. Editing an existing version is simple. Just select it in the Working Version drop-down, for example 1.1. All subsequent changes are now scheduled for version 1.1. Please note that the changes I make for 1.1 are hidden from wiki users. Only authors and administrators can see them. Now let's make some changes. First, we'll edit this page for version 1.1. Just click Edit. Shortcuts also work. I delete the current content and enter the content required for version 1.1. Then I click Save. As you can see, I've changed the page. When I switch to the currently published version, which is visible to all wiki users, the page still displays the old content. But let's change back to version 1.1. Now let's create a new page that describes a new feature for 1.1. Now enter a page title and some content, and then click Save. You can see the changes for the 1.1 page. I'll switch back to the currently published version. In the navigation tree, the page title is grayed out and there's no content. This means that the page is not available in the currently published version and therefore not visible to wiki users. But when I select version 1.1, the page is available in the tree and the 1.1 content is displayed. Let's add a few more pages. And when I'm finished with all the changes, I publish a version 1.1 and make it visible to wiki users. I click Browse Scroll Versions, then open Version Management to display the existing versions in this space. Here I can create, modify, and publish a version. Publishing means that I make the content available to wiki users. Now, publishing can be done in two ways. I can publish the version to the same space. This means the changes for 1.1 are copied to the pages that are visible to all users. Or I can publish the version to another space, a new space. This creates a simple confluence space of the published version and it does not contain any scroll versions related information. For this example, I'll publish within the same space. There are a few optional settings here. The default should be OK, so let's click Preview. Here I can review the changes. For example, this page has been updated. Clicking Show Details displays what has been changed. Here you can see how the contents changed. Now I'll close again. and the list displays other pages that have been added or removed. Everything looks OK, so I click Publish and wait a moment. When I open the space again, you can see that version 1.1 and the currently published version display the same content. If I log out and log back in as a normal wiki user, I can see the changes I've just published. Also notice that there is no sign of scroll versions because it's so well integrated that the space looks just like any other Confluence space. So that's it. I hope this explained how scroll versions helps you manage concurrent versions in the same Confluence space. If you have questions about scroll versions, please check the K15T software forums or feel free to contact us at any time. Thanks a lot.